guys since they're not cooperating many places. I'm just here to catch a bunch of dink bass. They're all eight and nine inches, but it's a lot of fun. And I did get one crappie last time, so you just never know. This little hole is just loaded with fish, I'm telling you. Absolutely loaded. If it's like last time, I caught 40 bass in one hour, so probably gonna happen again if they're cooperating. They've all been caught probably several times, but still a lot of fun. Got it. And I could be wrong too. It could all be these little dinks again. I think that's all that can really survive in here. If there was any nice fish, people would get them out. And they leave all these and they catch them over and over. That's what it's looking like. Again, I did get the one seven inch crappie last time. Two large mouths. Dink. Dink number two. Better than catching nothing. They're all the same. It's like you just stocked a farm pond with bass, and eight months later, this is the result pretty much. I think they were all born this year. It's still better than nothing. They're more on this right half than on this left half, though, because it's shallower down there God. no they're just trapped in here and everybody if there was a one or two nice ones they all got caught and kept these are all the ones nobody wanted they've probably been caught 20 times Ooh. What? Oh my God. See, you just never know. I, I caught 50 fish out of here last week and didn't get any like that. My goodness. Well, guys, like I said, you just never know. I caught 50 bass out of here last Saturday and one crappie that was six inches, she just caught a 10 inch crappie. Whoa. Hold on. My goodness, you just never know. Hold it up for us. Let me zoom. Man, see? It's just the spillway is just too high. We got to come when it goes down. Man, you just never know. I can't believe that. Out of all them I caught, I didn't even come close to that. Goodness gracious. Oh my God, I was reeling it in and something grabbed it right there. <sighs> Crappie, you know, that's, the, that's the size of the one I caught last week. So there's more than one in here. My gosh, you just caught more crappie than I did out of 50 fish. 
Because I caught 50 fish and one crappie. You, you already caught two crappie. Yeah. Now be quiet now. You're, that stick is, you're making waves in the water. God. Crappie. Where? My goodness. Three in one day. My gosh. Well, guys, this took a turn on us. I come here last week, caught 50 bass and one crappie. We've caught five crappie and about five bass. And it's just strange. They're just totally different. Like I said, you can never tell, and it was worth trying this time. Now, where am I supposed to fish? Another yeah, largemouth, guys. This guy's really dark. Got a really dark black. Almost look like a little spot, but they're largemouth. There's no spotted bass in here. None. What is that? Sunfish? You may have something weird. A war mouth. Yeah, all right, guys. She caught a little war mouth. Yeah, he's just real pale. Sure is. She caught her a little four inch war mouth. Pretty cool. Yeah. Huh. Bass. No, war mouth. Awesome, guys. We each caught a war mouth. We caught five crappie. My gosh. Now, this mine's a little prettier. All right, guys. Little war mouth. Pretty cool. Man. You just never know. A little warm mouth. <laughs> That's awesome. bigger isn't he? It's pickerel. Whoa. Awesome bonus catch guys. This may be a grass pickerel too not a chain. Let me see here. If this is a chain I didn't even know they were in here. That's a chain pickerel. Oh my gosh. Here. Wow. I had no idea them were in here. I knew there was grass pickerel. That's a chain pickerel, not a grass here. Take that. What a surprise catch, guys. I had no idea this species even existed in this place. Little chain pickerel. He don't even have any teeth yet. He's so small. He has three teeth. That's it, three teeth. He's a little 10-incher, guys, but... 
No. You sure he's all I on the think screen? He's not 10 inches. He's about 10. Probably 12. No, 10. 10, 11. Him? You sure I'm on the screen, the whole thing? Yeah. Okay. What a nice surprise, guys. I like this place now. <laughs> I had no idea them were in here. But we'll see now, what I'm starting to think, that little creek that comes in over there, that one, see that little creek over here? No, this one. Mm -hmm. It's crystal clear. Maybe it's that. Could be a spring fed. That is a chain picker, not a grass. My gosh. Weird. How did I catch nothing but bass last time? Now we're getting all kinds of stuff. See, it was the best day. If we would have went somewhere like the Black River, we probably would have caught all kinds of variety. We caught a lot of variety. Yay. Crappie. Crappie? Mm-hmm. Oh. Hey, a white crappie. All the rest were black. This is white. All right, guys, we've gotten four black crappie, one white crappie, two warm mouth of pickerel, and about 10 bass. Mine is a white crappie, the big one. Oh, well, it was. Yep, you're right. The other ones were black. I definitely had one. There he is. Little large mouth. I'm gonna try to use it again. Found. Crappie? Yeah, man. I'm gonna have to get another picture. He's a keeper, too. Man. Another nice white. I get a nice one two times. Oh, I got one. I got one. My God. I missed my chance. Hold on now. <clears throat> Boy, I about slid in the water. Man, lucky. Nice Turn lucky. around. My gosh. <laughs> Man, she got lucky twice today, guys. I did get the pickerel. I got the weird fish of the day, though. And I got the pretty, pretty warm mouth. Hers was dull. But she got both big crappie. God, you'd look at this place and how in the hell are they in here? That's just strange. It's beyond strange. Bass. Probably the biggest one of the day, though. Close. Yeah, they're largemouth guys. What a day. We've only really fished an hour. We caught easily 20 fish in an hour again. <laughs>